Hello, Hanul here. Welcome back to another round of Rising Lords. Um, one of the last rounds, probably, depending on how everything goes here. So, last time around, uh, we took Rickard up here on the eastern borders to try to take Argon, but we were turned around or pushed away. And we took St. Ormu. So now with our rest of the troops, with a few mercenaries and a bit of rest, we are going for the next one, which is Bedani. And we try, there's some here. And uh, there's a wooden castle for 250 and there's town guard. So this is going to be a hard fight. Let's see if we can do it in 10 rounds. And take it and put this red player under pressure or the red player that is the black prince and on the western front we had a small group of uh, people with another troop of mercenaries and we are on our way to the west and take over Arden and get hormone Kurfels and maybe uh, our home Tannheim back and uh, last time around as far as I remember it's been two weeks since I did or did play um, I think we had another round of bad harvest in fall and are looking down the barrel of starvation. So let's check our regions and how we are doing and what we can do to help. So over here we've got two rounds to go in Othel, which is summer and then it's this round, the next round and then we get a harvest again. And why does the wheat look different? Did something change? Oh, it's just coming out, okay. Could be that something changed, I don't know. Uh, we wanna try to get rid of these wolves and we are producing, uh, our four war machines, we are producing a bit of stuff. Overall, this looks to me if that it's fine. We are under the threshold and we are Surviving. That is surviving. Oh, diplomacy. Ooh, okay. Cultists, Tancred, Camillo. Camillo is open borders and peace proposal. Okay. And over here, they've got a peace and we are at war with Cultists and Gotica. Okay, good. Fine. Nice to see. Uh, then, over here, we've got Ulvador, uh, our first main region where we are losing people left, right and center. Of course, we last uh, recruited here a bit. And uh, right now we had uh, the bear problem and lost a few people there. But food wise, we are looking fine. And yeah, we grow these sheep further. It's one shepherd, two guys here, so that we get uh, the pl uh, replenishment here and the castle. Sounds about right here. Nothing to do here. Nebulo is one of the main regions we have to push up. And there's wolves again. Like we are getting overrun by wolves. And food wise we are looking okay-ish. But I think we want to start building... When the wolves are gone we want to start building these ramparts around here. There's a possibility to build fences to ward off the wolves in the future, at least around our fields. That's what we're gonna do. And this is one of our main regions here. Also, uh, some of you suggested that we can upgrade this one here for more people. And we get more fishermen and a discount bonus when buying and selling wares in this region. Okay. And if you upgrade it, uh, we can use it to transport around people from north to south, which of course is interesting but there are no yeah there's a port over here and over here can't see if there's a port anyway um region in itself looks fine ish we are putting people to work here to get food in which is important and get this one back get a bit of this and that uh looks fine so over here next one this one is struggling for real Half ratios, not really doing fine. Getting into trouble next round. What is he building? We have been constructing an inn. 
and we need to get around in here. Uh, money looks fine, but we can not. What can we do to help out? Put this one in here. Mm, could maybe save him. I don't know. We are already eating the cattle away. Oof. That is not looking good. Uh, let us put a bit of food from Uvedar over to... What was it called? Olgarat. Uvedar to Olgarat. There it was. Um, we give it around 200. Um, that should be make it three. That's sufficient. So next round we have everything we need. Yeah, we cannot go above half. Okay, fine. And from the resources, uh, we could build a castle over here just to make it safer. Right now we are... I cannot build ruined and abandoned structure from long ago. Not much of use. Maybe some of it remain can be used for new building. Okay. Mm. Nabulo is our main region and we are already trying to... Uh, uh, dancing around the maximum we can but we've got another field open we've got cattle coming in we've got two of those getting the sheep in yeah so what we want to do here is we've got a stone castle we've got a church we've got an inn we've got a bathhouse and we upgraded Nabulo right so what we can do is we can upgrade what we have so if you upgrade the church oops, that's not what I wanted Wrong button. Yeah, well, okay. Now we have to upgrade it. Upgrade it. Uh, get a bit of these in here. That's three rounds. Get one of the... No, let's keep the stone guy because we want to build the other tower. That is 800 wood and 400 stone. And wood is a problem because the bear killed two of our guys over here. I remember I'm still salty about that bear overall that's it for now we move on and we try to <sighs> after assessing the situation we try to get in here see what we can do if we can do something And uh, I think the Gotika are going for these lands down here. Yeah, seems like it. There's one on the border here. They are probably trying to get it. Peasants have killed Wolf in Nabulo. Peasants have killed a Wolf in Othil. Perfect. That's what we want to see. So let us see here what is going on here. Where's the army gone? It's gone. Fine, fine by me. We just move in. We've got a garrison, so that's what we have to deal with. And here they are coming for Hormund, it seems. Oh, and some guys are coming for the Kurf, uh, from Kurfels are coming for this region of Arden, which we want to take. So let's move in, see what happens if we are fighting for a neutral region. Got a new general, we've got some unhappy people in Ormu, that's fine, the beast is slain, population is dwindling in Samarond, Samarond was down here, oh right, I did not check my other holdings, sorry, my bad, oof, that does not look good, okay, we are way off what they can handle, but <laughs> let's look at it this way, they are trying to get in the game next round it's food time again so let's splash a bit here and get in the food and let's watch uh, over here Salsholm is not really supported we will stay on half rations we we get stone from here right oh gold income okay perfect and down here Ormu. They are really, really suffering. No rations. We are suffering badly. Okay, he's still trying to put out the fire. 
They could revolt on us next turn. Let's see what happens. Okay. Um, the were the ones who are the ones with the wolves here? No, you, Nabulo. Okay. What the smut? Is something happening? Are we in the are we in a Halloween part? These are skeletons. What is happening? Is this a Halloween uh, Halloween thing? Black crops. Skeleton horses or sheep or this is funny. Uh, we wanted to build anyway. We wanted to build this one. Keep the sheep safe. And uh, yeah, we have to get more wooden. But for that, we have to grow this region here for the woodsman. Okay, move on. We need more wood some from somewhere way 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 more wood okay i'm interested now to see what happens down here in the west where the um the ai is coming in with their troops trying to take the land I'm interested to see if we both fight for the neutral. Oh, the preacher. Tancred is quenching his first at a stream in the forest when he hears a rustling behind him. A man dressed in simple clothing stands before him. An amulet hangs from his neck. The man's deep voice is gentle and has a strange effect on Tancred. Solus be with you, Tancred of Tannheim. He smiles softly and raises his hand. I am unarmed, as you see, as you can see. He looks at Tancred insistently. You cannot defeat us, Tancred. We are too strong for you. Who are you? My name is Gareth of Erigo. Erigo, and I lead the renewed church of Solus. Tancred's voice is raw with anger. You bring nothing but disaster and ruin to Oblin, Gareth. You have no power to judge me, Tarnheimer. The time of kings and counts is over, Gareth says loudly. For this is the fifth kingdom, the kingdom of iron. Now the chaff will be separated from the wheat and the wheat. Won't cheat. The <laughs> chosen ones will live in a kingdom where none rules over another, and all serve only God. Join me, and I will let you keep Tunheim. Your brothers and sisters murdered my father. Your captain Runford burned our castle and devastated our fields. Tancred snarls. Gareth remains calm. Count Tancred, my followers act of their own free will. I give them no orders. For the sacred fire of solar burns in their veins. Whether they seek vengeance or forgiveness is their decision. Runford is a creature of society's injustice and brutality, a servant who sacrificed all he had and received nothing in return. He smiles again. You should ask Ranford the next time you see him, but I don't think you'll like what he has to say. Tancred is stunned to hear it. What does he mean by this? But Gareth turns and disappears into the darkness under the trees. Slowly Tancred feels himself coming back to his senses. What's that witchcraft? Oh, blessed with fertility, okay. Interesting. 100% birth rate. And we are going for the region to claim. And then we have to take a stock of what happened here. Some things happened and we get now the food so that we can readjust the food our regions get to grow some of the regions because our western side the eastern side is strong nabulo uh, but the western side is uh, rather weak and i don't like it because we have two big regions the west and the east and both of them are very very weak anyway let's move in look at this uh, this is barriers this is barriers uh, we put these in the forest, right next to the village, we put these guys. Is there a hill? Forested hill would be preferable. No, there is not. So then we put these guys down here. Put these guys down here. And put these guys down here. Ourselves in this position and we have to see what we can do. Except. And they start again. I still don't understand who is starting and when. Okay, fine, they are holding. 
I don't like this one. Oof. We are losing many troops, many, many troops. Uh, first strike on this one. Formation on this one, as these are coming in. And fake orders. For now we don't need it, we just move in here and kill this one. And then hope the best against these others here. Um, I would have loved a ram here, to be honest, to get in the uh, city. But rather than that, we move around and next turn we attack the main castle. Shoot. Oof, this one. Nah. Too late. Next turn, maybe. Here they come. Oh, 45 is not good. Well, 8 is manageable. Please attack the merchants. Yeah, the mercenaries. Not merchants, mercenaries. Still no rams. If I attack this, oh yes, please. Kill him off. That's his leader gone and a victory because they broke instantly that's good every one we do not lose is important because we are now up against the big army of uh, gothica or however they are called the gothicans way down south and we have to keep these lands uh, and get them up to speed to make them new grounds uh, where we can recruit people because right now they do not like us one bit ghosts of the past the ancient argon tree looms out of the mist the cages containing the poor victims of the last king of argon andros sway in the wind the trees looks the tree looks dead and barren as if only fruit has long been the cruel cages on his branches break the chains Tancred strikes at rusted chains with a sword. The tree groans as it's waking from a deep sleep, but Tancred doesn't let up. As soon as all the chains are broken, he notices people from the surrounding area are gathering and silently beginning to clear away the remains. Is the curse of Badanin a thing of the past now? We will see. There's the tree. Ugly thing. Uh, let us see. Plenty. What does he have? He has normal people and a bit of spears. Does he have anything here? Yes, he has a stone castle and a garrison town guard. Ooh. So attacking here is not wise. We could try to get this one, uh, which is Torasso. Could try to get Torasso off the hands of the neutrals. But this one is clear for now. Here he could get in. But if we can defend this this part of the of uh, our lands, we are safe. So how about we upgrade this one, get wood back, and use our stone we have plenty of. Uh, we got a s okay. We got enough incoming to go for normal double ratio to get the people on our side. Even better yet, we can buy more wood to build the second uh, thingy and we buy a bit more wheat here to give us a bit more of pu push. Let them keep going at it, right? Yeah, okay. So, question is, do we go up? I want to replenish here because plenty against this castle is is uh, coupled with a lot of losses for sure so i'd rather try to take this away from them but i'd also like this hmm. okay you know what we go up north and see what he does if he comes for our land we go against him if not we are fine and 370. Wasn't it 7? What happened? How 
what what happened here? We were 720 people. Can I only do one fight around? Tankred, the elite, uh, archer, spearman, battle report. Oh, we kept all of them. Hmm. Don't know what happened here. Gothica come Harmon from the people. Tankred conquered Padan from the cultists. Okay. Hmm. Whatever happened. I thought we had more people here, to be honest. We do not fire them. We get a bit more of these in here. Okay, we have to buff up this one, I guess. Get more of these in. Get more of these in. And get more of these in. Oof, that's a lot. Can we even support that? No. How about we go this way? They have no food left. Spend general XP. Uh, we want to get uh, in here with a bridge, this one, and then a ram. Okay, at least a ladder. Yes. Uh, yes. And with this army, we move on to his troops. You go for this. How many are there? Three, okay. Stone and wood and nothing else. Ooh, it's fall. In winter, we want to switch out these for uh, for crops. Oof. Uh, we need to send something to Arden. Um, yeah. Arden, Arden needs food. Who can give him food? Wow, they are getting a lot of food. And they are way... Wow. Okay, we need to build this quickly, build this up. We need the people in here. Okay, they have food now. They are growing as well. They are at the limit and they are way off. Oh, well, the 100% did help. Next round we get the in here, that's good. And then we clear this. And then we can see what we want to do. Uh, how about now we take you two and put you on this field to start clearing it. And we want to find a region that is not too far off. Oh, right, we got these people. Get them in here, we need more wood. This one, eat it. Okay, still grow it, fine. Let me put you on the wood. No, I don't know what happened here. Stop it. Somehow my game is lagging right now. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You are doing fine. Also no, no one here. It's unfortunate. Where? Not here as well. Hmm. No merchant anywhere close. Very unfortunate. Take you, go over here. Help out with the fire. Okay, first off, we build this tower now. Can't afford it. 800 and... Oh, 400 stone, right? We don't have the stone now. Next turn. Um, how are we dealing with the food shortage? It's a very important question. And we will definitely switch over to this over here. Hmm. Okay, you know what? We bring in the food from here, everything we have, to Arden. Was it Arden? Oh man, I'm so bad with names sometimes. Yes, Arden it is. Okay, Arden gets all of your food. And it gets all of your food. Well, there's no food left. Here's no food. Here is a bit of food. How long does it take? One turn. Fine. Send it all to Arden for now so they can survive. 
we need it as a new ground to help out here. Okay. And down here we are okay. We are building the wooden castle, uh, the stone castle. What is this? An iron mine and there is a field with no horses on it. Okay, we see we use it. And Sengormu is suffering a lot. Wow. Okay, next turn maybe we get a few people in here. Oh, wait a moment. Whose livestock is dying? Ah, this one. Yeah, well. Happens. Happens. Uh, let it die. I think Ormu is really struggling. Really, really badly. You need to pull it up again. Okay. Let's see if we can take a bit more of the map for now. Crops reached. That's fine. We have to do now a game plan. How are we dealing with this? big fat stack of enemies uh, battle of Arden go to battle this time we do it ourselves it seems like the second battle was not in our hands it was a uh, random don't know why because they had 100 people in the beginning and it was 720 and they lost a lot of the, the peasants we took with us I hope the other one is not against us and will help us at some point. So, yeah, how are we doing this? Um, put these right in front. Put these, oh, there's a hill. I'd love to put them on the hill there. Put these in here. Put these up here. And then these two in here. The these up here. Is that all they've got? Oh, wow. Um, I don't want to lose some of these. Play it safe. Put them down here. And put us with these guys. Okay, we are starting this time as we are the defender. So it's always the defender going first. Fine. Um, give this one as decoy. You get the formation. You get also... No, there's no shields up necessary. A first strike on you. And right now you can stay. This decoy is going here. Let him waste a turn. And we're way off. But we can delay his turn with the idea to wait for these two to move. And then we can move in here or you move forward with the uh, with our bowmen so that we are in a better position next turn. Okay. Great. Now they are open uh, to an attack. Um, begin with this one. Only one, it's fine. Uh, the swordsman in here, kill him off. And now we can move out. Maybe we can take the hill next turn. Formation and okay. I mean, it's all mercenaries. That's no one we need to worry about. All fine. Yeah, that's the ones we are. We are really worrying about our own troops, but s looks fine so far. Okay, give a first strike to these guys. Give. Who is it? You can move out. 
no need to die. Yeah, he's fine. Okay, there's a decoy. That's gone. Yeah, attack him. Nice. Okay, another one down. And with a force march, we can even move in here or attack him. Two to four, perfect. He's close to finished. First strike, exactly. He is so dead and we want to kill him off completely. Don't want any survivors right now. Because I don't want him to retreat to his own lands. I want him to die and lose this general with all of his troops here. Very important. Yes. Good play. We lost, we lost only mercenaries, I think. Yeah, two spearmen, two swordsmen, 12 of the mercenaries who are coming back and regenerating. That's fine. I'll take that. And now we move on and take his lands. Also, let's see if we can get the the alliance with the with Hormund. No, not Hormund. Oh, what's it called? With C. Something with C. Man, my, my brain and names. Tell ya. Camillo. Camillo it is. So. Okay. First things first. No troops here. Move in. There's a stone castle here we want to take. Uh, I want to take the XP. I want to take the rams with us. One ladder, one ram. Sounds about right. Move in. And what do I see here? That's a court here, right? So that's swordsman. No, that's not swordsman. But yeah, that's swordsman. I think that's 100 swordsman. That's 200. What is what? Wait a minute, let me see that. Uh, here. Town guard is a spearman and the... Around the castle, this one. Town guard is spearman and I think this one was a swordsman. Let's search our own castle here. I think... No, I think that was a uh, swordsman. Where is it? It is this one. Courtyard. Swordsman. 30 only. Okay. Okay. Hormund is taken by Gattaca. And there's a bridge over here to them. But if I read this correctly, they are peaceful so far. So we can move on, take this, and maybe take back Tannheim next time. And get him uh, get get a car under pressure so where is he is he on the border to us no he's not okay Arden is twindling let's watch that Arden is over here is dwindling I know half ratios let's go still half ratios wow okay but they are recovering fine Nabulo is suffering. Oof, a thousand. Uh, the fields are getting sown. That's. Can we put one here? Yeah. And we put them into this to get the monies. For seven, and uh, we are fine. Okay, Nabulo is dwindling. Who's unhappy? Arden is fine, they are coming back to us. Uh, St. Ormu up how to take arms. Yeah, I know, I know. Get food in here, just food for now. Normal rations should be fine. We are surviving here, should be fine. St. Ormu should be holding now because we are getting up there. They are growing. Construction complete of an inn in Olgorod. Uh, whoop. How far are you? If I put these two down here, we get this out of the way. And we got what here? Livestock. And this one is 
livestock as well, sheep and cattle. Yeah. Okay. Fine, fine. Mm, crops reached and looted. Okay. Okay, let's just scan it quickly. This one is winter. Oh, we need money. Uh, we need uh, crops in here. Otherwise, we do not survive. And we need iron. Hmm. Our iron mine is not used right now because we're getting the fields ready. Okay, let's build the tower first to see what is left. Bit of wood. Can we build a shed around here? Stone, we need 50 stone. Because I want to take the one guy into the iron mine. Uh, 50 stone it is. Let's take 100, it's fine. We upgrade this to that, so that they do not die, and we take him onto the iron mine. Still not enough. How is it not enough? Why is it not enough? You can also get this one. Put him in here. Why are we not getting any iron? What is happening? Is this a bug? Oh, we are using too much of it. Okay, okay. I get it now. Okay, you go here. Now it's enough. Yeah, the boom. <laughs> pushed them up. Let's go half rations again here to keep them under control. And this one is now close to maximum capacity. Fine. Food is coming in. We want to build more stuff in here. Oh, they will not survive. Normal. Got two people. Definitely one here. And what is this? This is under construction. What is it? Whatever this is, we put someone here. Hmm. Let's see what comes out of it. Yeah, kettle is growing. You are fine for now. Let's keep as is. And we wanted to switch someone to crop. Okay, they are cropping, they are cropping two crop fields, okay. Let's go to normal. They are building the castle and this one has another field in here. Okay, let's do two fields, fine for now. Who did we want to, there's one we want, ah yeah, right, 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 I now understand. We wanted to switch out this one for this one. Put them in here. Yeah, fine. All three of them. More food. Grow this. We need to grow this. More people means more resources. And we move on. Yes, we let the livestock and Arden die. That's the plan and go to a crop-based food system. Why are we not getting any stones and wood now? Is uh, an arrow up there? Or is it just calculating and giving us stuff? Ah, there it is, okay. Good. Blood. I do bring a flood of water upon the earth to destroy a flash rain this April farm and then you have and everything uh, shall die. Chance of flooded fields. Okay, we have to check our regions now where there is a flood.
Man, that's so micromanage intensive. <sighs> if I want to keep them all under the control, on my, under my own control, I could put them onto menu uh, on the auto. But uh, yeah, yeah. Well, I could, I could feasibly do it for the eastern part right now. Plot down a building at some points, and uh, the rest can be auto managed. Sounds about right. So, who's storming the castle? You. He's probably sending in his shooters. So we want our melees going here and ram through it or climb over it. We want to put the mercenaries right here. We want to put these guys here. Perfect. Then we put one down here. One down here. One down here. Uh, last move. I wanted to put these guys here, but now that he's there. Ah, Forested Hill, also strong. Put him here. He put walls all around? Yeah, he did. Okay. Yeah, fine, that's just mercenaries have added. Okay, there's the ram. Rams through walls, that's perfect. We've got formation, we give it to you. We give the first strike to him. We give a first strike to them. And we give a decoy to them. This one can stay. Unfortunate that the Yeah, unfortunate that the people here are just uh, well the fastest and cannot do anything. Okay, please shoot at the spearman. Oh. He did not shoot. Why did he not shoot? I don't understand. He should have shot that. 7 to 11. 14 to 22. We shoot him. Hopefully he has nothing in it. Yes. Thought he maybe had shields up. Or the... And yeah, now he has something. Probably now a first strike and shields up. Okay. We want to hunt him. As is his main guy. Oof. Oh, that's... That hurts a lot. Why are they not shooting? I don't get why they are not shooting. First strike. That's fine. I can live with that. Okay. You go through here, please. Just kill him off. Now the... Crossbowmen are next, and you go after them. Oof. Wow. We give him a bind. It's ten. Yeah, we are losing a lot of the mercenaries. Fine. Uh, we want to keep him here. We need to get in here, quick. Okay, the spearman. You give a force march to this one and pull him right over here. Into shooting range of the rangers. Yeah, they are dying. The mercenaries are dying. Kill this off, please. And next turn we climb over these walls. We just go into defense mode. Do nothing. Just stay here. Keep him bound. And right now you go with ladders, please. And we are through next turn. We can move in. 
shields up. Sounds about right. Uh, shields up for you. I'll give it to yeah, give it to him. You just stay. Okay, can we shoot him? Seven of eleven. Yeah, shoot then. Just break him. I think that's the quickest way. Oof, that hurt. Ooh, they're still alive. Give it a ram. And we move through here. One more turn. Is it down? Uh, get him out of here. If he comes, if he follows us, it's fine. Attack him, please. Go in here. Okay. They are breaking now. Another. He's dead anyway. If he comes after us. Shoot them. Okay, there's the shields up gone. Okay, plan is to rush him and get a moral loss. We are still fine. We are still fine. Don't worry about it. So, we are through. We want to moral loss him. Yeah, you are down. Um, no. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Was the move I wanted to do anyway? Nice. They are broken. Oh, they are still sh still shooting. Nice. Reduce damage, but we are still shooting. Break him. Okay, next turn he will attack us. Um, get these guys out of here. And you move in, please. Break him. It's not enough. Wow. Mm. He's still not broken. Impressive. Really impressive. This should be it. Come on. Still not broken. Are you kidding me? Run away. Just run away. Okay, now they are broken. If they are not broken now, I don't know when they will ever break. Mm, move to the bridge. Turn 8. Come oh, we have to kill him now. Otherwise, we lose on timeout again. That's not what I want to see here. Now. We have it. That's Kurfels for us. The Reconquest is moving on. Kurfels is ours. And I think that's the last of the uh, rebels or the, the cultists. I hope they do not rise up somewhere in Ormond again. Or in Ormu again, just out of the blue. Because, well... He told us so. Oh no, Tannheim is still left. Sorry, Tannheim is still a thing. Right. You get to work here. You can stay. Funny thing is, uh, taking this helps because uh, we will replenish troops here and we already have a small contingent. Always. Kurfels is conquered. Johan rushes up to the stairs of the main tower. Tankard follows him, but Johan is too fast. When he catches up with him again, he sees him kneeling in the throne room looking up. Tankard follows his gaze and is startled. A small figure hangs above the throne. It's Helena Hungbear. Tankard helps him cut the dead woman down from the beam and carry her outside. They are under a large bramble bush. They dig a grave together. Johan says a quiet prayer. She may have been mad and mean, but his mother was the last of his family. Tankard is waiting outside the ruins when Yon finally joins him. Let's go, Tankard. We have a score to settle with the cult. Good. Okay. 
we are doing fine now. Can we move over? No, we have to move to Tannheim first. Okay. What do we have in Tannheim? Flooded, flooded, nothing, nothing, broken, no castle and a small army of stuff. I think we can take that. Is Kurfels ready to be... Yeah, we can get a few of these in here for sure. And I'd like to take... No, we cannot, right? Yeah, that's all we can do. Okay, fine. Fine for now, move on. Tannheim, maybe we can take Tannheim. Over here, he's still in his home base. Is he? Yeah, he is. So we can move in here, take this, take Tarasso, and then come back here, swing around, come back here. So let's quickly scan the land. Uh, flooded, flooded. Ugh, what is happening here? Why is three not enough? Okay, you know what I'm gonna do here? I am going to give him the free reign over this. There it is. Let's see what he does with it. Half ration, half rations. Mm, okay. If this is what you think you should do, fine. Let's let him have the control over this. And maybe we even put down something else here. Or upgrade the bathhouse. Also good. But it just gives... That's already upgraded. That's also already upgraded. The inn. What does it bring? Even happier patrons. Let us build... Houses 250. And a, uh, a spearman. Building something... We can build dwellings. Which puts him to 5-2. I think he can handle it. Why not? Do it. And then we'd watch the rest here. So. You. You've got flooded fields. Put everyone here to work it out. Over here. Flooded fields is also really bad. Ah, okay, that's the sheep, right? Okay, it's a sheep field, lucky. Here, the sheep as well are broken, but we have three already on it. Doing fine. You. Or we can also... What is happening if I put this down here? Nothing. Fine, keep it that way. Over here. Auto. He is doing that, okay. So, we've got crops killed off. That's bad. Real bad. We want to do crops here as well. This is horses and this was... Cattle. Okay, let's keep it that way for now. Blood warning, angry crowd. Okay, look at Arden. It's fine, it's working. Oh, cool. We can uh, buy a bit of food here, which puts us to eat and normal rations. Strong. Now we need money. Where's our money region? Over here. Yeah, he's putting everyone down for something else. Yeah. Okay, fine. Uh, let's check the new region. That's fine, you are doing something and uh, you are getting food in, that's alright. You can auto-govern, that's fine. We don't need more out of you for now. Then let's check the eastern part. This one can also go auto. This one can also go auto in my opinion. Whatever this instruction is. Ooh. What are you doing? Don't let the cows die. 
Why are you letting the cows die? Do not like that. Go back to your cows, at least one of you. Uh, and we need more... Yeah. Need more crossbows. So. Okay, down here, Sengdormu. Ah, you... No, Salsom. Salsom we put on auto. And this one, Sengdormu. Still struggling. Not as bad as before, but still struggling. Well, let's do it on auto. Oh, Tower of Samarond. After long hard graft, the old tide house has been rebuilt. Citizens of Samarond look proudly upon their work. At last, merchant ships will be able to safely enter the harbors, and Samarond becomes wealthy once more as a gift. The merchants send tankred gold and weapons from the forges of Samarond. Nice. Good. We've got three of four. The fourth is probably down here in the south. We are going in here. No, we do not need to buy anything. You are moving in. That's fine. You already have moved in and moving over. And we are doing fine. We're moving on. Maybe taking back Tunheim. He's definitely taking this in the south here now. We move into Tunheim, we move into here, and then we try to swing around here and take this out. Take it from Tunheim take it and try to box him in into south mm, wow four turns later the wagon reached Arden from Nabulo anyway we've got two fights again no we got only one fight good claim the region against some people we should be able to handle that one it's just garrison. And then we move west, take something from the Gatikans, and then we move south. That's the big game plan. West and south of Tancred, and the second general is moving into Tunheim and from Tunheim southward, and take the western part of the Gatikans, and then we just box them in. That's the plan, at least for now. We are. On our way to reconquer. Oh, okay, 50 57, okay. Okay, okay. Put him here into the forest. Put them into the plains. Put him here. And put these guys. There is no. No, it's plains all around. Oh, I should have put them over here. Over here would have been hills. Helpful hills. I am stupid. Wow, that's a lot. It's more than I thought it would be. Incredible. Yeah. Okay, it's our first move. Uh, formation for you. First strike for you. A bind, not yet. Fake orders on not needed now. Wow, uh, can we attack this? We can, but whose turn is it? They are going, they are run, they are on, and I would be smack dab in the middle of this. But who's next? You are next. Do I have a force march? No, I have only a bind and fake orders. Mm. We delay. We delay this turn, let them sort it out, and then we move in. These guys can move up top here, into the hills. These guys can shoot 11, that's good, they are dying anyway. You wanna do fake orders, take it away. Whatever it was, take it away and shoot them. Mm. One turn too late, next turn. There's enough targets here. Yes. Very strong. So. Where are we going with this? I want to go here, 
but then I'm in striking distance of this. I think I go here and then we move on to these up north. Five and done. And then we can move in next turn and kill these. Ooh, big hit. What? What is that range? Are you kidding me? From here? Wow. Okay, plan is these guys move in and uh, try to get closer to the spearmen and the bowmen. Bam. And these come in the north and take this. Okay, they're still living and you are fine, hopefully. Okay, good. So exactly how we wanted this to go. And now we move in, we surround them. You can kill here. Nice, merchants, always good. Uh, mercenaries, not merchants, damn. Always good hitting the mercenaries. So decoy on you. And then shoot the area here. Does it take a target a three tile area and do record damage to every unit on those? Yeah, that's sounds like friendly fire is is possible here. Okay, then we don't do it, we just shoot them. And they are close to finished now. He's gone, they are down, they will die. Yes, uh, kill them off. Ooh, decoy. Stop it. Just, just break and die. I don't need you surviving here. Okay, I think that's it. We are finishing this one. 9 to 15, 4 to 5, kill him off, perfect. And that's broken. Quick, easy, nice, that's Tannheim back. Army gone, we have to rebuild it. I want to build a snow, a snow castle, a stone castle right away to get it up to speed, keep it safe and make it our new headquarters to recruit and move out okay it's loading it's loading it's loading back into the game Ooh, it automatically rebuilt us the stone castle nice love to see it thanks game really love that move in here do we have enough food we have enough food we need to build something here, possibly. How about... Put it on auto. Okay, fine. If that's the way you want to do it, fine. Put it on auto. So, Nabulo, Twindling. We are just make a quick turn and check everything and then we move on. Nabulo is dwindling, is fine. He's ha has it under control, hopefully. <laughs> Yeah, we built the dwelling, perfect, and he spread it out around, fine. Rebel at hand in Arden, I don't think so. We're now, we're now stabilizing here, this is fine, no tithe needed. Kurfels is unhappy because we took it right now. Oh, we did not take Tannheim, sorry, we took the neutral region. He is still down there, okay. That gives you a chance to move over here come on move can we say recruit can we recruit here yes we can oh then we f certainly recruit here we need new troopers here 100 we need new here bring him down to normal levels fine and a few more of those one two Perfect. Perfect. Move over to Tannheim and uh, to Palmbach. The rest is fine.
this is doing fine for now. What do we have? We are building the castle next turn. We've got a stone castle. We've got the garrison. So we should be fine. And we have to recruit something. If someone comes, we can hopefully muster something quickly. And over here, how many are those small? Can he take it? Can Jorn take it? Or do we wait for Tancred? I mean, Hormund is gone and they are moving on to the south to steer. Does he have anything here? He does not has nothing except for these people. And there is a few of everything, but small is probably as big as mine. Okay, you know what? Bring him back. You just go in here and try to replenish. New general construction is done. Crops arrived. Conquered. Looted. Okay. So, thank you for watching. We are finishing here. It's already an hour again. Time flies in this game. I think one more, maybe two episodes, and hopefully we got this in the back and got Oblin back under control here. So... Thanks for watching and see you with the next one.